Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me Christmas memory. Morning everyone, happy Monday. Monday 21st of December. Cannot believe how quickly those nine days off went. <laughs> so quickly, if you think about it, we had nine days off, it just flown by. But we had a really lovely time. Um, we've got three more days of work and then it's Christmas break. So I think it's gonna be a busy three days. Um, Rich is trying to work on the laptop. We're waiting for his laptop table to arrive, which is like a desk, um, like a, a bed desk which we'll show you when it arrives. Um, so I'm gonna make some coffee and get the day started. So I forgot to put the dishwasher on yesterday. I loaded it up, I put the dishwasher um, rinse aid and the, the dishwasher tablet in, forgot to press the go button. So this morning I'm gonna have a nice little mug, because I do like a smaller one with the coffee. I'm gonna go with this Tokyo Disney one, which has got Tokyo Disney C. I love it. So um, let's make some coffee. Good morning, happy Monday. Only a few more days to go until the Christmas break, yes. <laughs> um, but Luke is just taking me to my physio appointment now. Hi Luke. Hello. <laughs> um, so my physio was pre-booked for today before the incident happened and I emailed my physio um, yesterday and she came back really quickly and said I'd still like to see you. Um, see what's going on and there could be some activities that we could do so hopefully this is still going to be worth it today yeah, you've been having physio every week haven't you for the last like every, 10 weeks every week for the last 10 weeks i've been going like clockwork so i feel like i put myself back but you know i'll just get myself back up again it's not the end of the world well, hopefully the specialist calls today because they they said 48 hours didn't they and maybe hopefully today or tomorrow they'll call yeah so normally pre-covid um i would have gone straight to the fracture clinic in person but now they're doing all virtually so i've got to wait 48 hours um for my referral from a e to the fracture clinic they call me and then go from there i'm sure my specialist will be informed who dealt with me from the initial incident so so i've got my laptop basically it's about half an hour so i'm going to work from the car so yeah i've done a couple of times needs must <laughs> i just bring my laptop and then I, I park up in the in the physio car park and connect by my phone yeah and then i'll just work um while rich is in there yeah because <laughs> it's quicker than going back and forth back and forth by the time i get home and it's not yeah so at least i can work while you go for your appointment i just feel lucky that you're able to do it for me yeah so yeah so very thankful for that so yeah so i'm on my way to physio and we'll see how we get on just been. <laughs> what have you ordered, Rich? <laughs> Luke didn't know about this. <laughs> I ordered a mini eggs bar, um, which I've been a little bit obsessed with since I saw it on an Instagram page recently. We were um, trying to find it in, obviously it means going to Home Bargains or I B &M. Did, It wasn't in B&M when we went in there last time, but it was about £4 something on Amazon, so I overpaid, clearly. So you'll enjoy it every little bit. <laughs> yeah. Evening. Good evening, I'm here as well. What a day. You standing up? Yeah, I'm standing up. <laughs> what a I'm day! Just leaning on the kitchen side, <laughs> returning from holiday from a week off, and then obviously with everything going on around the world in the UK, bit of a nightmare day. So you've not seen much of us up till this point. No, nope. you're mega stressed. Mega stressed, like literally mega stressed. Because um, your desk, Rich's desk bed hasn't arrived yet. It's due out between six and nine. Yeah, um, and you've been trying to work on one screen. On your lap, one one laptop bed. on my lap using the what's it called the the mouse touchpad. touchpad instead of a mouse, not having a keyboard, not having a second screen, everything's taking five times as long. <laughs> so Rich is likely to have to work again. I said, look, have a break now, five o'clock, have some dinner. It's my mum's birthday today, so like all lockdowns, we've all probably had almost all of us have had a lockdown birthday now, where you, it's a Zoom call or a a FaceTime. So we're FaceTiming at six. Yeah. Um, our lovely friends, Felicia and Mitch in the US, have kindly sent us dinner tonight. So kind of them. So Thank we, you so much, guys. So nice surprise. Thank you. Um, really nice. They just wanted to do something for Rich, which is just so sweet. They're the kindest people. Yeah. Uh, even though he said no. <laughs> <laughs> but we're having a, a Nando's. We fancy some, you know, you fancy some chicken. I've You've got, got some chicken. I've got some steamed broccoli. I didn't know they did steam broccoli now, but yeah. so I thought I'd choose that as some veggies on the side. So we ordered that from Delivery and it's due in a minute. So we'll show you what we've got. Yeah. But I've gone for a veggie wrap. The veggies. So yeah, no play big plans tonight. We can't do anything, but we're in the festive bubble. So it's going to be a Christmas movie. Yeah. There's going to be some Advents, 
So whatever happens with work, we can close the door on that. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, yeah. Yeah. So we'll see you guys. The goodies in a have arrived. Delivery, so good. Secure the bags. So I'm going to get these all ready oh, for so Rich. The food is here. You can see the steam coming off the broccoli. I love that. Wow. So Rich has gone for broccoli. Yep. I've gone for rice. We've both got some chips. You've gone for a half chicken. Yeah, it's um, plain. Plainish. Yeah, plain. plain. <laughs> and I've gone for a wrap, which is lemon and herb. Ooh. And I also snuck in a drink for it. What? A peach <laughs> tea. Oh wow, that looks so good. <laughs> it's so nice you like that. Yeah. And then some peri sauce. So we're gonna enjoy this. So thanks again, Felicia and Mitch. Thanks for everyone. Rich's bed desk has just arrived. I'm gonna build this for him and I'll show you when it's done. But it came so quickly from Amazon, so that was a big relief. So we're gonna get in and have a look and if you didn't know it was made in China. It looks like it's just a case of taking the packaging off it doesn't look like it needs any putting together so um I'm gonna crack it open and then see if I can work and it out. Voila here it is it's quite quite big it's very sturdy it's got like um the legs that come up on the bottom so literally just a case of folding it up and down but obviously it means it'll go over his lap and then he can fit his hopefully fit on here laptop keyboard it's got a little cup holder Obviously, it's got like an iPad holder there, but not bad for $24.99. Good evening. So we have just popped out to get a few essentials, um, just like some milk and some bread. Uh, we're lucky enough to live near a relatively local store, which is really handy. So Luke's just popped in. It's also nice for me to get out and get some fresh air because as much as I want to go for a walk um, or a jog or something, get some exercise, with my leg situation, that's not gonna happen. So it's nice that I can just jump in the car. Well, not physically jump, but you know what I mean. Just um, hop in the car um, and just um, get some fresh air out in the car. So that is what we're doing right now. So yeah, we'll fill you Before in. I forget, I just wanna talk about the desk, the mini desk that Luke bought for me from uh, Amazon. It is so good. And he was so nice thinking to me for that because it's just so perfect. So I have actually this evening tested it out. It fits my laptop really well. It is big enough for probably the wireless keyboard that I have with my laptop and my mouse, which will make tomorrow so much easier. Because today it was just so difficult. And I'm not sure if you can sympathize, but when you're used to working with two screens and a laptop, and you go down to just one laptop, everything just takes like 10 times as long. And when you've just been away for a week trying to catch up and then it's busy as it is. So I'm probably gonna be working tonight uh, in all honesty. So Luke will probably finish off the vlog tonight. We'll, we'll definitely do the advent calendars, but finish off the vlog together quite early um, because it's probably gonna be a long night tonight, but hopefully tomorrow is a better day. So back from the shops, I went in for bread and milk, which I got. <laughs> they only had the large milk, I got bread and milk. But while I was in there, obviously it was very quiet. I did the opportunity to get a bit more, a few more things that we needed. So we got a broccoli for our Christmas dinner, some apple juice. Rich doesn't like orange juice, but I figured he needs to- Here's your heartburn. <laughs> so he needs to get some juice in. Got some chicken for Rich for his lunches. Um, these are for Christmas Eve, Tex-Mex style. They've got some garlic mushrooms. Rich has got some bacon for Boxing Day. Yum, yum. Loomy bites for over Christmas. And then some pasta and coleslaw. And these Maltesers just happen to be at the till. I don't think I've ever tried them. I've seen them in the shop so many times. But... They look so good, so we had to get those as well. And that's what happens when Luke goes shopping. <laughs> Time for the musical advent calendar. You got me today. So we are looking for day 21. So day 21. Oh, I like that one. That one puts me to sleep. <laughs> but let's see what chocolate we've got. Today we have got uh, milk chocolate with angle sea sea salt. Ooh, Yummy. Really yeah, I can have that one, yeah. They're all lined up below, <laughs> Nah. <laughs> we've not been getting through them as quickly as we'd hoped. No, we'll, just, we'll just add that one in. There we go. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Tonight's movie choice is... A-lister. Miracle on 34th Street. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening. 
Vlogmas day 21. What a Monday it's been. It's been it's been a Monday, definitely. <laughs> it has. So just getting that Christmas feel now of like Friday's Christmas day. We're so close. Yeah. So excited. Can feel it. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got a few bits to go through. We've mm -hmm. got um Rich got a little gift today from our second cousin. Amanda. My, my second cousin, Your Amanda. Second cousin, yeah. Do you want to show everyone? I will, yeah. Shall I read so the card? You can read the card, yeah. So it's a lovely card. Um, I hope we're back in the park soon from Amanda and family, which is our second cousin. Thank you so much. And also, she put in the collectible key from Shop Disney. So nice. The Disney store. And wrapped it in Disney tissue paper. Mandalorian. It's so cool. I know, but we didn't have this one, so thank you so much for sending that to us. Such a it's nice really gift. really kind. Thank you. Thank you. You'll love that. Yeah. Hello. If only it opened the key to Disney World. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, thank you so much. It's really nice of you to do that. Thank, thank you. you. And then Advent time. So it is day 21. So yesterday's question was 20. Yep. And Rich has misplaced his phone. Yep. There it is, underneath there. Under there. He's got to get saving, used to sitting down. Saving paper, yeah, I'm not used to lying down. So the question yesterday, and well done to so many of you who got the question right. So yeah, well done. good responses. Um, was six. six. So well done. And what so, are their names? Their names are, uh, I'd be honest, I didn't know the answer to this. So um, uh, their names are Atina, Alana, Adela, Aquata, Aquata, um, Arista, and Andrina. Okay. Yeah. To watch more of The Little Mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> so we had some correct answers. So um, Di Vane, um, Happy Christmas from Connecticut. Happy um, Christmas. Lovely words from the N for the NHS. So glad Rich is on the mend. Fingers crossed for the physio appointment. Um, I think the song goes, our seventh little sister, we're representing her to you. But in truth, it's been years. It's been years for us as well. Um, it was my first Disney movie I saw in the theatre though. I could burst out all the lyrics to Under the Sea if you're interested. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Natalie Shepherd, I think Ariel has six sisters, you are right. All with A names, no idea on the names, you and me both. I think one is Athena. So lovely to see Luke's mum, nan and granddad. Lovely messages from Aww. them all. Wishing you a speedy recovery, Rich. Oh, thank you so much. Um, and then we also had a comment from Emma Bailey. Uh, Ariel has six sisters, if I remember correctly. Couldn't name them if I tried though. Hope you're both doing well. Your family is lovely. Wishing you all a happy Christmas. Stay safe. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. I just want to shout out to Andy who commented. <laughs> Ariel has six sisters, Daz, Purcell, Fairy, Bold, <laughs> Ikova and Surf, which are all brands of laundry detergent. This one made Luke laugh. It made me laugh because in the UK, Ariel is a laundry detergent. <laughs> so it did make me laugh. <laughs> so well done on that one. You took with you that one. <laughs> do you want to do today's question? Yep. So today's question, which... Is it going to be easier? I think it's easier. I think it's so easy. I think you're going to know the answer. Okay. Okay, what is Mulan's male name when she disguises herself? Okay, I do know that one. We haven't even watched the new Mulan yet. But... I know, we're so behind. So, what is Mulan's male name when she disguises herself? So, if you think you know the answer want to have a go, comment below. Yeah, thank oh, you. That rhymes. Comment below. <laughs> um, I just, just want to say, like, so many emails have come through and they're so lovely to read and I know I promise to respond. I haven't we haven't been able to respond to as many as we'd like to have. Um I think we'll be probably be responding in January <laughs> at this rate. But um they are so lovely to read and thank you yeah. so much for sending through. I just want to shout out a few. If I miss yours, really sorry, but we will respond. Um there was a really cute email from Danielle in Oxford and her little picture of her cat Hoshi, which I hope I pronounced correctly. <laughs> Super, super cute. So, love seeing the cat pictures, everyone. Um, also, this one is from, I'm just going to get the name, Deborah in Oregon. And has also included loads of Disney stuff. You literally have a house full of Disney and loads of Disney Plutos. goals right there. Um, and really cute kitty as well is Palette. So, thank you so much. Uh, Maria, Greg, Dana and Chris from Broomfield, Colorado. It's really cute Christmas tree there. You've got a little white Christmas tree on the top as well, which is so nice. So Merry, Merry Christmas Merry to Christmas. you guys. Loving all the Christmas trees coming through. Um, also an email from Eva, I hope I pronounced that right, in Poland. 
Apologies if I pronounced that wrong. Uh, wishing us Merry Christmas over in Poland. Merry so, Christmas to you as well. I believe you have some Bath and Body Works stores in Poland. So there's, yeah. <laughs> if ever was an incentive, that is, you know, up there. We want to go to Poland anyway, but yeah. Also, an email from Shane. Obviously, really sorry to hear about Rich's dislocated knee. Um, oh, and also um, did something in winter 2018. So... You can um, feel the pain sympathize. then. Sympathise. Yeah, it's <laughs> not nice. <laughs> uh, also, love an email from Cassie in um, Cleveland, Ohio. Um, really nice email, so thank you so much for sending that. We've had a few emails from Ohio, haven't we? Yeah, yeah. definitely. Uh, and also, Claire, Andy, Isabella and Madeline sent a really lovely, lovely email, so thank you so much, thank guys. Thank you. As Luke um, says, we, we absolutely love reading every single one. I can't thank you enough for taking the time to email them with pictures as well. Also, just one more. I've got one more. Um, Lara in Frankfurt in Germany as ah, well. Hello. Sending some lovely pictures. So, um, it's just so lovely. Sorry if we've missed any. We'll try and do extra ones tomorrow as well. Yes. And maybe on Christmas Eve we'll do all the ones we haven't got to. But... And we will catch up. Yes, yeah. definitely. So lovely. And now it's time for Genevieve's Christmas Advent. Yeah. Am I going to open today's? Yeah, because yeah. you've got a bad leg, you can open them all. <laughs> Thank you, you're very kind. <laughs> I've got to find the clue. Um, I've already started opening it, I'm so eager to find out what it is. Here we go, day 21. Day 21, yeah. The clue is... Bar none, a yummy way to start the morning. Bar none? A yummy way. Is bar a clue? Bar none. Uh, bar none. Bar... Uh, coffee? It could, it could be coffee. Yummy, yummy sounds like it's more foody. I think I was on the right track with bar. Okay, go on, go on, what is it? They are Trader Joe's, rolled oats and chocolate chips, fiberful granola bars. Oh, I love granola bars. We love granola bars. Thank you. We often take um, granola bars with us to the parks in the morning. They're so American. Um, Trader Joe's Trader stuff Joe's. is so nice. Yeah. Um, thank you so much, that's I'm gonna, so nice. I'm gonna count that as a correct guess. Personally, because I said like bar was that a, a clue? Uh, maybe granola bars. Too. Maybe no. Okay, half, <laughs> half, a point, half a point. Half a point. Thank you, Genevieve. Very nice of you. Thank and you. And anyone for the tea? Anyone else got a tea calendar? Tea calendar. Today, pucker. I got a cleansing one, which is a radiant blend of fennel, nettle, and peppermint. Obviously, peppermint's great for digestion, so that sounds nice. Yeah, I'm not sure about fennel, though. No, what did you <laughs> maybe, get? Maybe that is good, but I don't like the taste. Uh, day 21 for me on the Fortnum's one is vanilla nougat, or nugget. <laughs> <laughs> nougat. nougat, nougat, nougat. Uh, I feel very British saying that. Uh, flavour black <laughs> tea. British. Nou no, I know, but you know what I mean, like nougat. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? <laughs> nougat. Um, vanilla nougat, flavour black tea. Very nice. Smell it? <laughs> that smells good. Strong, strong, strong. Strong, is strong yeah. yeah. Uh, so, cool. So, we'll see you guys tomorrow for day 22. Yes. Tomorrow, we are, we've decided we're going to make cocktails in the evening. Why not? Yeah. We've got a margarita. Without, but without medication. There'll be no medication no. involved. We're not mixing medication with alcohol. <laughs> Being very responsible. So, either a strawberry daiquiri or I'm thinking a margarita. Yes. So, we've got to decide between the two. So, yeah. stay tuned for that. See you guys tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh And I've been long to hold you close Forget about everyone else Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories